see if they decide to smoke out, look for a first blood. Hattori already heading across the map. And uh, the drawing is made. We'll see if they, it looks like they're set to run right into each other. Level one potential. We've seen some of those level one raises get some early kills here. Mm. We got, got some on both sides. We got shards, right? Got a little bit of ogre just getting in there. Got crystal actually, maidens. Yeah, this is pretty scary. Yeah. For, uh, I think Beast Coast, the dire jungle, really scary to walk into. There's so many of these high grounds that you just have three different hills looking at you, but they kind of just pass each other. Yeah, they're looking for that safe lane right now on Beast Coast. Get a ward back behind the tower. We'll go for some courier snipes. And it looks like. And heading down to the rune spot, they will show C Smile. Yeah, throws out a raise. It's there on to one, hits a second, in some trouble. The shards pushes them to the side. Everybody getting hit. A really good avalanche from C Smile. And he gets a little bit of separation. The clockwork, body blocking, finding the kill. First blood taken by Whisper. Oh, C -Smile C -Smile. still running. He's he still getting chased and will go down, yeah. Gardic also chased back behind the tower. Five stacks, six stacks, and it will be enough. So Smile to nine for nothing. Oh, oh well, that was close. Well, oh, Gojira all that equilibrium. And down bottom. Down bottom. Stinger caught in the shards and yeah. a couple quick punches. That's going to be the death of the CM. That is the Crystal Maiden experience right there. He's already kind of gearing up to be this wow. run around hero. Yeah, very mobile. It's Lumiere up top. Will get blocked in by Gojira. Battery assault combo together with the now Flame Grake on to guard it. Can they bring him down? Couple more punches. They won't He's go all the way. Yeah, he decides to oh. die. So, Whisper with the double kill. <laughs> that's that's usually what happens. Let's see if it happens here again. And Gardic caught underneath those cogs. Couple more punches and he is dead. Whisper dominating. His own just in time. Kills one camp. Gonna stack up as well. So, will start getting back on the board. And see Smile caught in no man's land. Slowed down Avalanche to try and get a little bit of separation. But in the end, with everybody walking forward, see Smile, he's gonna go down. It's a pretty big kill. This pressure is going to be on analog to kind of step up Trying to just because of how his safe lane's going. Yeah, but that cog's pushback is really nice. That could have turned into something big with the haste and then also level six on analog. And now, it, oh, if he gets caught here, this could be really bad. Does not have a ton of mana. Gets pushed back. The flame break. They're bringing in people to try and help, but Stinger there as well. Gardic underneath the cogs is dead again. But that does make sure that Ember can get out of there. He just needs to be able to tank up at some point. The Tiny will go in at least in the early game, but he needs to be a strong hero on his own. Well, the Olicor uh, really wanted that bounty rune. Mm. Close with how well this Batrider lane is doing. And now Analog moving into position. Finds him with the root, gets him inside. The Spur making the move over. Wants to try and play aggro here. The root, the lasso, oh. they brought everybody. They take him down and now chase for more. That was not the thing that they were hoping to happen with that Invis rune. As the ogre will burn. No neutral need denied. Oh, okay. Or two. That's a little something, but they will catch the Ulicor on the backside of this. The chase down continues. And a pure victory. Ooh, still trying to maybe, escape maybe. the Ulicor, maybe? A possibility? Livid? Snowball? <laughs> Staying alive a little bit longer. He's hoping, but eventually the I mean is coming. But also, are you going to be able to deal with it? Analog gets pushed back. They're keeping a little bit of separation here as he stole that DD away from the Ember. Slowed down. Still chasing. They're throwing out the Avalanche, oh. trying to elongate this fight a little bit longer. Stinger up on the high ground, throwing out the CM ulti, not doing that much damage. And Gojira is just going to be the one that ends up going down. If this fight keeps going, they still have a lot left in the tank on Hakori. Trying to find the Shadow Fiend, that's the big goal, but... Yeah, and this is all while showing bad up Ooh. top, right? Toss. See Smile controlling, still has Snowball. Gets it out there. Vitaly moves into position. See Smile, he's in pretty far. Still holding on to that black hole, but with Analog in the area, they don't even need it. That was a really nice Tumblr toy. You know, provide them yeah. a body. And I mean, Analog now sitting still with two more remnants as well as they pressure this tower, so... Very hard to grab. They only have to really watch for the Gojira angle, oh, but he gets right in there instead. Interrupts, nicely nice. played. Connection yeah. for the kill, and Okori. Oh. Yeah, we got to farm. Like, everyone else isn't ready, and they do get the 60-minute rune, though, which is really nice. They right found there. him right away. Catch, Ava, toss, dead. Gardic trying to salvage something here, running in oh, that's, that's a juicy shards, though. Can they do this? Shards, block, stinger, their control. A lot of damage. They do manage to take off that freezing field. Analog hoping to get something done. A double kill from Whisper with that BKB. But can they get out after? Will Analog keep chasing this DD going? 
connection on to Sea Smile. Whisper still in the area. Vitaly has that black hole ready to go. Like Push back Anna. on to two and Sea Smile in some trouble. Gojira's off to the side. They don't even need it still. Wait, maybe a turn? Okay, K1, he's oh, decided to show up. A couple quick bucket. punches. Can they clean him up? It looks like they will. So another trade to a piece. Smoke up. Hakori, they feel like they want to get going right now. Who are they going to run into? Illusions out first. Smoke does not break. Hakori going to run past it. It looks like Beast Coast are in position. Yeah, Smoke punch. breaks now. They find him. Snowball follow up. Chase down, but the cogs, the pushback, interrupting Vitaly before the black hole comes down. Wraith Pack is there, but are they in too far now? Avatos from C Smile can't get it all. Oh, no. That black hole, it was not what they needed. Analog will manage to disengage, but they lose their Enigma and Gardic. He is likely to fall yet again. Chase down. Yeah, they got him. Beast Coast. They just. In this game, but yeah. Smoke up. They're going to look to Roche as well. They're going to move to top, try to get a kill into Roche. Hector, the exact same position now. Moving in, Invis, but they see him. Oh. Stinger, lots of TPs coming in. Whisper, he tried to get something onto the Tusk, but Stinger is already gone. Helio Core, they throw out the Requiem, trying to disengage with that Tusk. So support for support, get dead. Blink Tiny, he's thinking about it. See Smile, won't jump for that one. Happen. That flare just hit all of them. It's like <laughs> full vision of what they're oh. up to. Helio Core comes in, steals away that DD. But then loses his life for it. Guard it. Oh, Chase. Hookshot. hookshot onto Analog. Push back into the lasso. Catches him. K1 trying to bring him down. Slide of fist. Can he escape? No. Analog goes down. A perfect fight. And K1 just running in. Secures the roof for Beast Coast now. Hikori, they can't fight without a shadow for BKP. No. That's all I got forced back as well. Had to like blink out of there. So. Unable to find a counter initiation play. And just needs to power up his own BKB. So he can try and get involved here. But. Aegis now coming down, and man, Hector is a problem. This guy, after that heart, has been just buying some ultimate orbs, possible to this Aegis, and get the BKB on an Enigma. They're literally following the courier. <laughs> it brings him right to Theliocor. And uh, we'll see if they can bring him down here. The chase is out, but actually, they find Vitaly. The Enigma goes down to Whisper, as nice the blink. Tusk will get the blink out. Oh, Gojira. Oh, he's so good. He's actually so good on the clock. Okay, so here's what happened. So they run into Dilgor, and he's like, okay, well, we might want Tusk, but I'm going to go make sure possible to the Aegis and get the BKB on an Enigma. They're literally following the courier. <laughs> it brings him right to Theliocor. And uh, we'll see if they can bring him down here. The chase is out, but actually they find Vitaly. The Enigma goes down to Whisper as nice the blink. Tusk will get the blink out. Oh, Gojira. Oh, he's so good. He's actually so good on the clock. Okay, so here's what happened. So they run into Dilgor, and he's like, okay, well, we might want Tusk, but I'm going to go make sure that we get the Enigma kill, right? Yeah. So he runs over, makes sure Vitaly dies, and then he's in Wait between the two. K1 turns. Lumiere down low, still trying to pay him. He gets oh, the punches no. off the BKB out and away. Can he dodge through one? the trees? Might be able to. No. Hector chases him down, and now Gardic on top gives him the tip. Just like that, Hakori loses. It, it's all on the Enigma at this point. See, smile. They find another. Theliocore, body drop in. Situations to win the game are kind of getting limited with every single item that Beast Coast gets. Whoa, and look at this. Tier 3 tower. Hector, he's saying, I'm just ready to go. K1 takes down that tier 3 tower and. Oh, look at it. Chase jumps in. Topo Kangers forward onto this ogre. They do find the real one. But I don't know if they have enough to deal with them at all. He's still got the Aegis afterwards. The rest of his team is off on the other side and just keeps this chase going, taking down building after building and Beast Coast wanting to remain the dominant team here. They have faced him so many spots and been able to take down the Sakori lineup. Wanting to make it happen just one more time again. This is actually absurd, like how far all his allies are, but just, there, there's nothing they can do, right? Yeah. Look at that HP pool. Scotty's finished. Bachelor's gonna come out. They have three sets of racks. Yeah, there you go. That's a minute of time. Yeah. I mean, they're just not stopping. There's no reason to stop. Hector will not be denied another set of racks going down, and they still have 45 seconds left. I mean, it, they have to get something out of this. Hakori looking for an answer. Vitaly in the back. He's smoked. They need to kill him before they drop that black hole. Hector, defusal onto analog. They just can't touch him. No damage on this PL at all. See, Smile spamming the notice me. We'll see if they stick around for the third set, but if they want, they can just back here. 
brilliant play from Beast Coast is they do a tree volley. It feels pretty bad. Yeah, so he's just buying items for his team. Make it at this safe. point. Well, K1 going in without the Aegis. A little bit of a bold choice here. Again, the danger. Oh my god, Gojira's way back there, though. He's ready for the backline oh, jump. Analog, not there. And the lasso. They find and kill Theocor. He has buyback. Lumiere, they, they need it. They have it. have everybody. I mean, even without the Aegis, they're right on top oh. of him. Cox pushback. What if I tell you? Like, wait, there's a clockwork over here. And in the meantime, he jetpacks away from him. Hector keeps sending these illusions in one by one. Hakori. This, the smoke is there again. They got to find an answer. Theocor again scouted the smoke breaks ava toss connection Gardic throws out a stun good punches from lumiere can they bring down the tiny they will see smile dies oh, analog Molly. jumps in tries to find a couple more lumiere looking hunting they want to find that pl but it's not an easy ask to oh, get no. it oh, oh no. my god homie that was an illusion oh jeez. oh god that's not what it's supposed to go hector he showed up now they have everything on top of them K1 chase down Abyssal Blade there and Beast Coast, they're just too strong. So they run on through 19k gold lead, one last Rax, and GG is called. Beast Coast take the best of one and are gonna eliminate Hikori. Sending home their friends in the same region, but also their rivals, of course. The Korean team has been doing it so well lately, really impressing everyone. But Beast Coast say, you know. We were known as the gatekeepers once for region. You want to